All right, guys, here to talk about a storm again. This time it is a winter storm, starting to sound like it might be a blizzard this weekend. I'm gonna sound like a broken record on this, but if you have a saltwater tank, you've got a couple days in advance right now, go out and get a generator, please. You'll thank me in the end. Even if you don't lose power this time, you'll have it. You'll have that backup plan. You won't have to panic whenever you see a big storm coming. If you can't afford a generator, there are some other ways to get around this a little less expensive. Car inverters work great. Problem with the car inverter is you're not gonna be running your heater off a car inverter because it sucks so much juice. So if the power does happen to go out, fresh water or salt water, if you're running a rimless tank, first thing you should do is cut a piece of cardboard that'll fit the top of the tank, wrap that with saran wrap so it doesn't get waterlogged, and cover your tank with that, and then wrap your tank up in a blanket. It will help keep that heat in there a lot longer than if you just leave the tank sitting there. Fresh or salt water, there's battery powered air pumps. These work great. The batteries last about 48 hours. If you get one of these, get some backup batteries because when you're talking two feet of snow, if the power goes out, those crews aren't gonna be able to get to those poles and lines for quite a while. Have these kits now that have the valves, the air stones, airline everything is all together with them so you just come on in grab one of these grab one of these you're good to go hopefully we do not lose power if we do once again we'll go over worst case scenario stir that water surface with a spoon if you don't have an air pump or an inverter or a generator hopefully you all make it through this storm okay try to stay warm and please buy a generator it just makes everyone's life so much easier these critters rely on us. If you have a generator, you can run your heater. It will keep the critters nice and warm. And more importantly, buy gas for that generator because you might not be able to get to the gas station. Who knows how long you're gonna be snowed in at your house. Just get an extra gas can or two. That will help out drastically in the long run. Have a good day.